Hi there, this is Ian here again. And today our talk will be about fake it till you make it. Now I know many people are saying out there, you should be authentic, you should be honest, you should only say what's real, what you see, what you're experiencing. But I say, you know, knowing the laws of success, I want to repeat this again, you've got to fake it until you make it. You know, because you know why? Appearance is everything. That's right. Appearance is everything. You've got to appear smart. You've got to appear self-confident. You've got to appear successful. And then eventually you'll be it by appearing it. Because people follow appearances first. They believe what they see first. And when they see you as a successful person, you may not be one, but they see you as that. Then you inspire confidence in them, and they start buying from you. Now, you may say, well, yeah, you've got to first really be honest. Uh, you've got to really be authentic. I say to you, no, the, the, the laws of life, they function different. If you wake up in the morning, and you're not feeling so good, you're feeling miserable, you have a headache, you have a hangover, you're feeling terrible. Now you go with that feeling to work, and you are a salesman. You know what's going to happen. You're going to chase away all your customers. If you put those negative feelings simply behind you, stand up straight, stand up tall, and make as if you are feeling good, and when you do that, when you make as if you are feeling good and you go and present this positive feeling, this positive appearance, this positive picture in front of your customers, you know what's going to happen? They will believe you. You know, it is not always true that people can read exactly what you are thinking or what you experience. I've experienced this in my own life. Many, many a times I went through serious troubles. Many a times I went through dire straits. Many a times I really had to walk through the fire. But you know what? I kept it to myself. I didn't tell anybody else. People, even your closest friends, even my closest friends, didn't even notice that because I kept the appearance of being positive. I kept the appearance of being optim optimistic and I kept the appearance of being successful. And that's exactly what I'm telling you. If you want to be successful, appear successful. Make as if you are successful. Now, if you want to be rich, yeah, make as if you're rich. Now, I want to tell you something. Rich people do not spend because we have the idea that when you that rich people love spending their money. That's not true. The reason why they are rich is because they're saving their money. They're looking after their money. That's right. You look after your money. So pretend that you are rich. Look after your money like wonderful little children. And money will start looking after you. And that's exactly what I'm talking about today. Do that. Take on the appearance of being successful. Take on the appearance of being an expert. Take on the, ex the, uh, the appearance of being a professional. And sooner than you think, people will start coming to you. They will s assume that you are that which you said, which you appear to be. Now, you know, history, you can learn a lot from history. There are so many examples of people who have acted uh, kingly, who have acted royally, who have acted mysteriously, who have acted wonderfully. Now, I'm not saying that they fooled the people. They simply put on this appearance. And in doing so, they got people on their sides. So if you get up in the morning and you're not feeling so good, stand up tall, stand up straight, just do it physically. And by doing that, by pretending, I'm saying this exactly to you, by pretending to be positive, by pretending to be successful, 
you will start attracting the successful thoughts towards you. You will start attracting uh, the positive side of life towards you. You will start attracting positive people towards you. And it's everything to do with appearance. So have a look at your appearance. See what it's like today. Look at yourself often in the mirror and check because you don't see yourself every minute of every day. Other people are seeing you. And as much as your thoughts are very important, it is also very important how you appear in others, in front of others, how you appear to them. And so take on a good appearance, a good countenance. Smile often. I'm telling you, yes, smile often. Because by smiling, and other people looking at you smiling, they will smile back. Now, I know there are negative people out there who say, yeah, if you don't mean it, people will feel it. I say that's BS. If you smile with your whole heart, with everything that you've got, do you know that people will believe you? They will believe you. You know, I've been often to the United States of America, and I was always wonderfully surprised at how friendly people were towards me, you know, in the service, in the catering industry. Now, whether they mean it or not, I don't care. They were very, very friendly to me. You know, the waiters and waitresses, oh man, I would give them wonderful tips because of that, because they showed deference to me and they showed friendliness. And that's exactly what I say. Yeah, in Germany, you know, people tell you, you've got to be honest. If you're not feeling good, don't show, don't pretend. Hell, service then sucks, I tell you. So I prefer the American way when everybody's smiling at you because they want your service. It's okay, it's fine. For, it's fine. For me, it's fine. I like that. <laughs> so you have a good day, right? You just have an awesome day, a fantastic day, and I'll be talking to you again soon. Thanks. Bye for now.